Okay, increment the quotient of 6 and the number by 9. Increment the quotient of a number, number is x, and then the quotient of 6 and the number, the quotient of 6 and the number, quotient means division, increment that by 9, so just add 9 to that. And here we are. And then, what is the product of the previous result and 7? Product means multiplication of the previous result here and 7. You can put the 7 at the end, although most people wouldn't. Parentheses here are crucial. In exercise 2, the sum of twice the number, twice the number is 2x and 11, x means addition, and then twice the sum, first we get the sum of x and 11, and then we take twice everything that belongs to the sum. The parentheses are crucial here, the parentheses are not over there. Oh, that, set, that 7 should be an 11. That's a misprint I didn't catch. 7 is left over from the previous example. Okay. The ratio of a number and 4. The ratio of a number and 4. All that is subtracted from 12 minus 5, which is 7. So from 7, you take away x minus 4. Then the product of 8 and 4 times a number decreased by the total of one third the number and 19. The product of 8 and 4 times the number, so uh, the number is x, decreased by the total of one third the number and 19. Product means you multiply 8 by 4x, which gives you 32x, decreased by the total of one third x and 19. So the product is decreased, you subtract all of x minus 3 plus 19. 